Hello everyone, welcome back to this waking nightmare. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm just messing. This is gonna be great. We're gonna, we're gonna run into this dog. That's, uh, that's one of the pro strats that they don't tell you about. Uh, you won't get that from any other source. You gotta run into the, into the dog. That'll help, uh, cycle through your RNG. And, um... I don't know. I'm not actually going to say anything to you. Well, why don't you say the night first? And let him restore his life. Don't worry, I will sleep. Uh, well... Well, my red doesn't get to sleep. Peace out. Oh wait, I can't. Sector 6 is a little. Cloud does not know how to sleep in beds. Also, that bed is huge. That bed is enormous. Goodness gracious. It's like 12 or 15 feet long. It's, uh, it's this way, right? And then you do this. I'm home free. Elmira has disappeared. Okay, good. No random encounter. Cloud, what are you doing alive? You know that's not allowed. Oh, 37. Ooh. That was rough. Now we can really get back to playing this video game. For the one or two battles that are actually going to involve Cloud before he's brought back to life because of any number of reasons. Yeah, this was just gonna take a month and a day. Hi Scarlet, on the other side of the fence gate. This video game 
is still happening. In case we're wondering. It hasn't stopped. Scarlet does not have a face. Which is rough. But sometimes that's just the way things go. You know? So we have to go for best cloud dress. So that he doesn't get recognized. Or so that, uh, I'm, so that he doesn't get uh, in a fight. So I'm definitely going to be able to get to the point where I talk to the dress makers. Dad, we'll see how much further than that. We're probably also going to get through squats. That might be it for this this uh this session, this sesh. Genius plan. Cannot fail. So yeah, this route, uh, it's really it's really been optimized. Over the past few months we discovered some new tricks uh, that I'm gonna try and show off. It's not really marath marathon safe, but uh, if, it, if it fails, then I have a backup. So um, we're going to go in here and we're going to talk to the dad. And uh, what you need to be careful here is when you're uh, selecting the, 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 the options coming up here. I want to do something that feels soft and that shimmers, and so it's sort of a tricky tricky input and so you gotta watch that I'd like to give a shout out to uh, all the other members of the Final Fantasy 7 fake speedrunning community uh, they've really done a great job in uh, bringing us uh, up to uh, faster times and uh, they're just a really great group we have a discord group uh, if you want to if you want to learn how to fake speedrun this game you can check that out Time, time to hit the gym. This is gonna be a little bit risky in in earnestness because I'm gonna not do the practice, and that means that it's gonna be harder. I think. Definitely ahead, now I just need to keep it up. Okay. Good, good. Okay. Whew. I had a little, a little slip up at the beginning. Got me nervous, but everything turned out to be okay. Uh, and here's this secret passageway that I figured out, and we're gonna talk to this guy, 
And then... After we take care of this, that'll be it for this episode. And we'll go to the uh, Honeybee Inn next time. I thought he was T-posing for a second. You get a whole protein shake set for 200 gil. That's not bad. Oh, we just did. We stop. Stop. You should not be activated on touch. You should be activated on action. I'm not even gonna look you in the eye. Uh, I'm so mad at you. Vernon the Ding Ding. Hot pockets. Link cuisine. Thanks for watching, everybody. Remember, soul smoke is as dangerous as soul fire. Stay safe out there. See you next time.